Hi, I'm Dr. Yvonne Huang. I'm a PT at Rehab and Revive. I specialize in pelvic rehabilitation and lymphatic drainage. Today, I'll be showing you dry brushing of your legs. We talk about lymphatic system and lymphatic drainage in the prior video. So I'm just going to jump right into dry brushing of the legs. You can use a dry washcloth or Bristol brush for your leg dry brushing. I'm going to show you how to use the Bristol brush to do the dry brushing. Before we start dry brushing, we wanted to open up your deeper lymph nodes. So you're going to gently put your hand on your stomach and you're going to kind of breathe into it. We call diaphragmatic breathing. Breathe in and breathe out. It's been about a minute to kind of just gently stimulate the deeper lymph nodes. And then we're going to stimulate your watersheds, pathways, and your lymph nodes. You have important lymph nodes in the front where your groin is. So again, you can gently tap on it 10 to 15 times. Or you can actually just brush it upwards towards your belly. We want to open up your trunk watershed so you can brush it upwards towards the heart. Back here, there are two watersheds. One is at top of your pelvis where the bony area is. You're going to brush it out 15 to 20 times. Then you're going to move down to your buttock where we call the piriformis area. Same thing, you're going to brush it 15 to 20 times. Then we're going to open up the heart of water sheds behind your knee and to brush 10 to 15 times. And once that's open, then you're going to brush the entire back of the thigh. to do outer thigh where the IT band is, top of the thigh, and it's also important to do the inner thigh. And then don't forget about the top of your knee. Brushing it. Again, remember every area is try to stroke 10 to 15 times. Now I'm going to go down to your calf. Same. Top of your lower leg. You're going to go to your heels and your ankles. And breathing. Top of your foot. Bottom of your foot. I'm going to return it back up towards your knee. Your entire thigh. You're growing up towards your stomach. Your buttock. Outwards. Your back. Outward. And your trunk. And that's it. Hopefully you enjoy the dry brushing, give it a try and see some results. Remember, this is a technique that may take time to work and often need to be done daily. Every day, every day, every day. Check with your healthcare professional to see if lymphatic drainage or dry brushing is right for you. We love to hear your feedback and comments below. 
Let us know what you think of this technique. Hit the subscribe and like button if you want to see more of these kind of videos. I'm Dr. Yvonne Huang and thanks for watching.